remember the level to that. Guys, we're rolling. Episode whatever. Yeah. Uh, fucking, you know how you're talking about, like, you know, uh, the fake laugh, po- the politician fake laugh? Yeah. What's really funny, man, is, like, that fake laugh kills me. And sometimes I know people do it because it's a, it's a nervous thing. Nervous twitch. It's a nervous, or so they're filling space with it, which is okay. Yeah. But, um, you know, like, just on a smaller note, I, uh, like, my internet got turned off today because, uh, you know, I, I turned off my credit card, which the internet bill was on. Oh, I and I, I just forgot happened, about yeah. it. And it got turned off. Anyways, I actually got an American on the phone to talk to. Talk to. Problem was, this guy was fucking Ned Flanders with an attitude. He was Ned Flanders with an attitude. <laughs> he was driving down the street with a bumper sticker that says, I love your kids. <laughs> 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 so he did that in The Simpsons doing it. I didn't, him. I didn't see that, but that's funny. <laughs> that's great. So, but it, this guy was so irritating. He, everything he... First, he was like, oh, oh well, um, we sent out an email. I go, yeah, the internet's been turned off. He goes, well, it always happens that that's how we get your attention when you don't want to pay. And I said, I, I go, sir, are you implying that, you know, I immediately was like, are you implying that I'm dodging the bill? Mm-hmm. I called you. Yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah. I'm not dodging the bill. Okay. I need my internet turned on. I got a credit card here. Let's get going. Yeah. Let's move. Let's, let's and, do your job. Pedal every, a little faster. And he was there. like, oh, no, that's that's not what I'm saying. Is is uh, uh, sometimes when, and he's going through this whole story of talking with other cli- other people. And I'm, I, I, I go, that's not my problem. On the other end of the phone, I'm doing this. Let's yeah, go, let's yeah. go, let's go, let's go. And my God, dude, his laugh, he would say something like, ah, man, he would try to make a joke of like, oh, this darn computer, I keep trying to ask him to, to, to turn it in the max, but they want to go PC. Ha, 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 ha. Right, and the laugh oh, was longer than what I just did. Yeah, yeah. And you see how I tried to and, make my face and robotic, you, <laughs> and and you're already getting irritated, bro. You're you're already beyond irritated. If I'm a cartoon, there's steam coming out yeah, of my ears. Yeah, dude. and then there's that little cherry on top. Yeah, because yeah. and he's and he's being condescending about little things too. About if you just if you just paid it, we wouldn't be doing this. I'm and I'm going to. and I and I'm going in my head. I'm having a battle. Like I'm about to. There's two things. And one, I'm just going to hang up. Two, I'm going to be like, hey, can you send me to somebody else? Yeah. This is taking yeah, who, entirely who, too long. Who's your boss? Because you suck, dude. But I was already on hold for long enough. So yeah, I, yeah. I, I go, I'm going to get through this. And anyways, I go, I go, I did cut him off. He was telling me another dumb story and laughing way too long about everything. And I go, I go well, look, I got, a, I got a debit card here, and I want to give you the number. Can we get rolling? I don't yeah. have a lot of time today. Can we do this shit? Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, so let's get my computer to work. Oh, darn computer. Mm. <laughs> it was just like. It was Ned Flanders on the other line, bro. And so I had to bring my phone out here to, to show Jen. I go, look at this. I go, this is a real person. This is a real person on the other line. Hey, and you dealt with it all that time? <clears throat> that was a test of your patience, my friend. That's what that was. Because, uh, and, and it sounds like you passed with, with I, the flying I, colors, bro. I passed. I uh, gave the credit card. I, uh, but when they're that annoying, I did have some more questions that I didn't want to get into. Yeah. I just wanted to end it. Yeah. So I paid. I'm paying more monthly now somehow. <laughs> and you got hose, Tommy. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. So somehow I was like, huh? My, uh, yeah. After my a, bill went up ten dollars, and he was like, "Well, it, let's go back." And I go, "No, let's not go back. Let's get it done. Yeah. Let's go, Bubby. Yeah, <laughs> we gotta let's, go. Let's fucking do this, dude. Crazy, Shit. dude. But it was the fakest laugh you ever heard, and long. And why is it so hard for us to give you people our money? You well, know? Yeah. <laughs> Like, I swear, they're like, you have to have a username, password, and login for this shit. And you're like, if somebody wants to break into my account and pay for it, let them do it. Yeah. Don't fucking jam them up at that point, dude. That's just stupid. That's bad business. Yeah. You it, should be, fucking world could pay for my shit if they want to. Right. Right. We have to do all that, but it's easy for us to give you our social security and oh, everything yeah, else. Yeah. But if someone wants to break in and, and uh, pay our shit, well, yeah, that's hard. That's it. Mm. Yeah, I mean, because I'm always like, please let there be an American on the other end. Please let there be an American. Oh, dude. I got Ned Flanders. The, the only time I'm lucky with that is because, uh, you know, the coaches that, that, you know, we work with and shit, they're back in, like, Alabama yeah. and uh, Indiana and shit. Like, you know. Spot. You want a southern fella is what you want. Most of the time, but sometimes these broads are just as ditzy as the broads out here, and, and, and they'll do that. Really? The, well, you know, most of the time, they're very friendly. I'm not going to lie. And, and I'm sure that my accent from what they tell me I have sounds weird to them, but there's, there's sounds nice. You know, I kind of like that. And she's like, 
hey, this is, you know, blah, blah, they, blah. They got how, the southern draw. How, how can I help you? Yeah. You know, and I'm like, fucking right. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I want this. I want, generally, I've had good luck with the southern ladies on the other end. That's pretty oh, yeah. good. Yeah, and it don't matter what color they are, too, because I've, I've talked to black, white, Mexican chicks it, that are that are from yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I think there's a, that. that ho- they had that hospitality. It was a little. Oh better. yeah, dude. They're just so much friendlier, and, and when they talk shit, it sounds so much nicer. You know, <laughs> I'm serious. Like you, you ever hear a southerner say, uh, "Oh, bless their heart." They're saying, "Man, that's a dumb motherfucker." That's a dumb bitch. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah but, but they say, "Oh, bless his heart." Yeah. You know, you're like, I mean, "Oh, that dude's fucking." Yeah, he's challenged. retarded. <laughs> yeah, he's a challenge, dude. That's what they mean. <laughs> it sounds cool. So but yeah, that, I I can't handle that. I'm having such a hard time. I've been saying this. A long, for a long time. Because that's all of us, dude. Yeah. Every time you have to deal with, like, your credit cards, you know, uh, it seems like any kind of real money transaction, you're getting, hello, my name is Eric, and I am here in beautiful <laughs> sunny California. And you're like, fuck you, your name is not Eric, and your you're Indian, not in California. Your Indian <laughs> voice is awesome. <laughs> your name is Habish uh, Patel. <laughs> and you are here, right here in Los Angeles. I am enjoying the sun right now. You're like, dude, no, no fucking way. You're in a high rise yeah. office in the yeah. middle. Dirt. So, so I'll give yeah. him that voice, dude, and I'll fuck with him, you know. Nice. And I'm like, hello, my name is Justin. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, what can I, what can I help you with, sir? You know, I'm like, I don't know. You called me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, it'd be funny if they just go, they just go. That is not your real accent. You're like, that is not your real not name. <laughs> it's not your real name. <laughs> not your real name either. Yeah. The only thing that's a, that's funny about your you. name is not Tommy. <laughs> it's always like the most common American name Ken. too. You know. Yeah. 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 Something that really nobody uses so much anymore. Yeah. It's I, all. It's I, always a uh, hello. My name is Ken. Yeah. Or, my name is Bill. <laughs> yeah, come on, dude. Yeah, but because we can't pronounce his name, dude. So, but it's funny how. We have to give them our our uh, social security. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's like uh, I need your social security number, do all that, mm-hmm. right? And I'm just like, man, that's a lot of info for the mil- for these fucking dudes that are mostly these are the ones that are involved in all the fraud, all the internet fraud. Yeah, isn't that isn't that insane? What I have found out too is a lot of places that ask for it, you can still opt out to not give it to them. But if you don't give it to them, you you, you can't get your your shit done. You really can't. Uh, like, like uh, most of them make you feel like that. No, but I mean, uh, like for example, uh, for the uh, it, it's called EP Entertainment uh, uh, payrolls, and I can track all my payments from mm. SAG and all that shit. Yeah, but it's all sourced out to the fucking India. So everything is. But mm-hmm. I said that before. I go. I I really I don't feel comfortable you giving them. They're, they're like, I can't look into your account. Yeah, I can't give you, I need to know this is you because I need to, because I'm going to give you pay, payment information. But don't you worry, Ian. <laughs> it's your, safe your, to be. Your information is safe with Ganesh. has <laughs> many arms. <laughs> so I just go, you know what? Fuck it. You probably can look into my computer anyway. Oh, right? yeah, dude. Yeah. So I'm just like, here, here's all my info. If, go ahead and steal from me, you fucking assholes. Yeah. yeah it's, you know, even when I have been stolen from, everybody's like, do that LifeLock thing and whatnot, or or a version of it. You know, I, I heard LifeLock's a bunch of fucking, you're only dealing with fucking Hindus and whatnot, too. What's that, LifeLock? That's the one where, it, you know, if your information does get stolen, you're insured to get it back like that. Like, as soon as you call them and tell them there's mm. fucking fraud, yeah. freeze all your shit. Can give you, you just call them everything's stolen. fraud? You go buy a new guitar, guitar center, and you're just I like, mean, hey, that's fraud. I mean, they're going to give it to you right off the bat, but there's still going to be an investigation. Right. Yeah, so, yeah. Right. I, I knew some people that did that. Be, with, they'd get credit cards and shit, and then they'd just max it out. Oh, yeah. And they'd be like, dude, I got I got jacked. Yeah. <laughs> and I guess it would work, you know, sometimes. I guess it, when it's like smaller stuff, like gas or whatever. I don't know, with cameras being everywhere and shit nowadays, too. And plus, you got to have the, the pin for these things most of the time, too, you know? Yeah. Yeah, but if you watch, there's a... Uh, I watched a documentary on these frauds, you know, like a lot of these internet frauds, and they're able to mirror your computer. Are you, you know, understand yeah, yeah, that? So yeah. they're so on the other end is this they're kid, seeing, seeing what you're this kid doing. in India. So the kid in India will say uh, oh, something they, yeah, about they call it shadow, yeah, they'll shadow what, you or whatever yeah. it is. Yeah. So they they match the thing, and then they'll get you to send over some money out of your bank because they go, you don't have, something happened with your bank, I need you to send this transaction over oh, yeah, so we yeah. know the transaction works and mm-hmm. then we'll send, then they, we'll send. They it. send too much by accident. Right, right. exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. I, I know that scam. Yeah, we sent you too much by accident so Dude, I need you. I, I went down a solid rabbit hole with the guy that busts those fucking spots that does that shit. Yeah, nice. Yeah, Dude, 
for like fucking five days. That's all I wanted to see was these things get fucking blasted, yeah. dude. Because this guy would not only take all their shit, yeah. like, like watch it. They would watch. The, he's like, yeah, all your money it now belongs to the FBI. Nice. I've already informed them where you're at. And they're like, you don't know where we're at. And they'll call them by their name. They'll look up their profile and they're fucking, yeah. you know, oh, dude, just. So, if, yeah, if that guy can do it, imagine what everyone, what Bill Gates can do. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? The, in, the inventors of this thing. The, the inventors the shadow of the, games behind what we see. Just imagine if you have that sort of power. Like, like uh, you, you own, say you own Facebook or Twitter. Because you have to put in all your fucking profiles and blah, blah, mm-hmm. blah, blah, blah. Now when, you, now when you make a new profile, you have to take like a selfie picture of you. Of yourself and have, oh yeah have yeah they kind of want to demand it right away yeah but I yeah I've I've just taken a picture of a wall or something yeah oh that's a good move yeah. yeah so you yeah you do those things and then but they just imagine they have everybody in the world's information mm-hmm. they can look into their account they can look into their messaging yeah and these are just fucking people that started Facebook Facebook was started as a as a as a uh, to rate women on a at a college yeah I was gonna say a, a way to Pick up chicks, I thought too, right? It was yeah. It was like it was specifically for Facebook in a college to have all the hot chicks, and then guys would go on there and rate them, and be like, "Ah, she's hot, hell yeah!" It, now it's this global thing, isn't yeah. that crazy? Now people lose friends over that thing, dude. Because many have tried. When I had it, fucking yeah. dude, you know it's been over. It's been over ten years since I've I've done anything with Facebook. Beautiful, and shit. Yeah. yeah, beautiful. But uh, but yeah, I remember a bunch of my friends were you know fucking. When the uh, another one of them race divides was happening and shit, yeah. you know, and, and it was one of my black friends. He's saying all this shit and he's fuck white people and this and that. And I was like, "Hey, what's going on, brother? Yeah, you know, just just stopping by to say hi." Yeah, and he's like, "Oh man, you know, I I just got caught up in the bullshit. You get caught you know? up in it, and and well, I was like, Dude, yeah, don't let him. It's fuck not him. real life in there, but no. it does, it does throw a wrench in there, man. It does. I, I'm trying to fight it. I can't do it. If I see something that really fucking irks me. And now I know. I'm just like, yeah, I don't want to hang out with that person anymore. Yep. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. There's there's been several when I had that shit, yeah. <clears throat> and when everybody's dropping like flies. I mean, even people who came out the woodwork. Like one that mm-hmm. we knew that we didn't even trust back in the days, dude. You know, uh, we had a video where me and Drew were smoking weed, and we were watching out for this guy so he yep. wouldn't come and mooch our weed and shit. <laughs> Well, anyways, that same guy had hit me up on Facebook, and he's like, yo, I need you to be a character witness in this case that I got. And I was like, fuck you, dude. (laughs) I was like, I couldn't tell them anything about who you are now. I could tell them about who you were back then. Yeah. But that's been fucking, what, 20 years? Sir, he has a small penis. (laughs) Be funny (laughs) just to go in there and joke around. Actually, I thought it was his penis, but it was a mole. Crazy. (laughs) I guess you could call that a dick. (laughs) Look, it's a dick, but smaller. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> yeah it'd be funny to be like a character witness but really just be a jerk off about it <laughs> fucking with them the whole yeah, time yeah just to, uh, don't even take any of it seriously <laughs> how you doing judge what you doing after this like huh? i was thinking right. that would be fun to do uh, like a um you ever have you ever gotten a jury duty notice recently uh not recently no. i haven't either which is funny because i used to get them all the time i would too but i, I just I don't, chuck them i don't really think yeah. i have anything that my leads, mom just went to one, yeah. That leads me to me at my house or anything. Because parents still think you have to go to those things. Yeah. Like, they still think that. I, I don't want to get her. It says it's if you if you ignore it, you go to jail. Yeah. I go, they don't care, Mom. I, I, I go, I've mm-hmm. probably thrown about 13 of those away in And my I'm life. sure a bunch of those things get lost in the mail. I mean, it's not signed for. You can't prove shit. Yeah. You know, so but there's that, too. But, I, I'm, but I'm starting but, to think I, I, it'd be fun to go. Like, do you want to go, me and you? <laughs> Can we do that? Can we go in a pair? If uh, no, nah, but I don't want to get <laughs> caught up in a long case, dude. Because then you got to take days off of work. That's that's the double edged sword I, to yeah, that. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So I mean, it'd be go there to just to see what the case was about, and then be, and then you could pull off a jerk off move like I would, dude. Mm-hmm. You know, just to get out of it and be like, everybody's guilty. If you're here, you did something wrong. It's yeah. time to fucking pay. You know, you're so biased on one way like that. I'm like, yeah, dismiss his ass, dude. Fuck, yeah, but but I'd like to shit. I'd like to actually sit in the jury, and then make a mockery out of the jury. You know, like when they're having the jury meetings, I just bring up goofy ass shit and just piss everybody off. Nah, knowing knowing your luck, dude, you get some fucked up case, dude. Like uh, this guy killed a child, fucking rapist. Oh, it's, or it's something, something real shit. serious. Yeah, yeah, and then you're like, ah, that sucks all the yeah, fun out of that. it. Yeah, fuck <laughs> that guy. <laughs> kill him. Yeah, just kill him. <laughs> yeah, that's- yeah, I'd just be like, what? I'd be like, he did what? He, he molested a child. Kill that motherfucker, no, dude. Can we you, kill him? You know what's? Funny? I'll kill him. I've uh, commented on these videos on YouTube and yeah. shit, right? You know, just 
mentioning that we need to off these motherfuckers. Yeah. And I said, you think they're going to get better? I said, kill a few times. You know, they, they delete my shit when I say kill. Yeah. Because they want that unaliving bullshit. Mm, un- unaliving? Yeah. They, they don't like the word kill. Oh. Yeah, oh. That's you know, why I, you've been seeing that shit all the time. I've been, yeah, you see where they spell words different too. Like yeah. when they want to say something. Yeah. yeah. Even, uh, uh, what was it? Murder, I think, is one of them. There's, there's a bunch say of. Say red key, rum. Yeah. There's a bunch of keywords that they don't. But it's funny because fucking we do our shit and I don't ever see them taking it out. But, well, but when I when I speak on it, I'm talking about a child fucking. It's like, crazy. So the it's a convicted uh, child rapist. Child rapist. But I, if but I, I say, say kill him, or if I say I'm he's the bad gay. guy, yeah, yeah, I'm the bad guy, right? Like you need to be censored. We're we're very backwards, dude. So fucking backwards. We're very very backwards. But uh, not, they say not really like in uh, uh, like. Uh, X, which used to yeah, be Twitter. I was going to mention that, because too. Then, uh, because of the Elon Musk has taken that over, yeah. and uh, Rumble, Rumble, and all yeah. those those things like that. that, that are, well, let me grab another beer, but I tried yeah, to ahead. figure that uh, Rumble one out the other day. It's hard again, to figure out, right? Once again, I tried to figure it out, dude. I'm just not, That's I'm, why I, I'm I, not savvy with I want to be on it. I want to be on Rumble in a, in a normal way, but it's so much work. I can't figure it out. <laughs> and then I'll... I'll upload like a video or something, and then it it won't work. And I just sat there doing nothing forever, wasting, your fucking time. wasting my time, man. But I I keep saying this. I keep doing these on this podcast. Is I do need to step it up though. With the I have to do it. You know, with the social media and the fucking and uh and uh. That was my fucking knee. I know the dogs and these legs don't make it <laughs> easier. We have dogs under the table, yeah. and they're both their butts are right under <laughs> my foot and his foot. <laughs> <laughs> they have to be just right on. It's funny, like when I'm when I'm tattooing, the uh, they always come and lay on my feet. Like they want to come, and I gotta kick them over because one because uh, Sparrow <laughs> rolled over on my pedal, dude. <laughs> like the fuck? Like, oh shit, Sparrow! I, I had my machine on the table, and it just went. Poof. I was like, "Fucking Sparrow, dude!" Sparrow used to eat eat the uh, tattoo ink. Oh shit! Like one time, I got up and and we took a break, and Sparrow was in there. Oh fuck! <laughs> just in there. <laughs> nothing, like, no, she was fine. Nothing happened. I know, but but you're it's just on her face. <laughs> no, no, the ink's on her fur. I'm like, oh no, Sparrow. Yeah, it, it, not, not. I was like, it's funny the the constitution in these dogs, man. They can really eat some weird shit, and then it'll just pass through their whole body. That's a that's a beauty of a dog. It'll kill a Can't, person it, or a cat. We're so yeah. soft. Humans are so soft. Oh, dude, I was just thinking how gelatinous fucking creatures we are, dude. Gelatinous is the perfect word. Yeah. We're if you really think about it, like like uh, these dogs aren't in the gym, you know what I mean? But Phil Barron's neck, that thing is solid. That's yep. a solid neck. That's yeah. But if I don't go to the gym for one week, I'm I'm a, I'm, I'm soft, dude. My <laughs> bones get. You feel softer than baby shit, dude. Yeah, because that's what I tell myself too. And then I'll fucking jump back into it. And I'll fucking just, you know, be sore for. But it's even true. Like uh, lifting weights is very important for your bones. It yeah. it, it creates bone strength and yep. bone density. Yeah. And humans, it's really funny. We don't have that. If we do not uh, put strain on our bodies in any way, our bones will get very porous and and very weak. Yeah. Do- no animal does that. Like a monkey, a chimp is just born, can crush your yeah, face. Gorillas do, can rip your fucking arms out of They're your They're not sockets. working out. No. They're not on the tree fucking I know. You know, doing uh, lat I know, because I even thought about them dudes, you know, like the stories about guys that would migrate with uh, groups of gorillas and shit yeah. and like be a part of the fucking pack and whatnot. Yeah. I'm like, he's never still going to be as strong as these motherfuckers. They'll tear his head right no, off they, his fucking no- his man, neck. Man, I forget dude. what I read somewhere with the, a chimp's bite. Oh, that's it, a. They can like they can like let's put it this way: a chimp can bite through uh, that tire with the air yeah. and, and pop the tire. Oh yeah, that's yeah, pretty that's, wild to think yeah, about. Yeah, they're gonna crush your skull when they bite. They you. can crush your skull. Yeah, yeah. no problem. Mm-hmm. So like when they're whipped, rip that chick. Oh, have you seen that that documentary, the chimp crazy or, or chimp uh, no. lady? No. I haven't either, but it's all the rage. It's the no. guys that did uh, the Tiger uh, King. Uh, oh, Tiger King. Tiger King. Uh, anyways, this chick that is in love with these chimps and she's giving them Xanax and shit and all kinds what of... What the fuck? Really? Yeah, whatever. But the, the this lady's friend came over and this chimp ripped the friend's face off, dude. So now the friend is like one of those people, you know, where they're all mutilated. Oh, yeah. They're mutilated face. Hand me my phone over there, please. Yeah. So I can play more Rancid because Rancid kicks ass. Fuck yeah, they do. 
So go fuck yourself, everyone who who's talking shit on my boy Tim, dude. I don't, nobody listens to the fucking. Haters nobody listens of, to that, anyways. You're right. Yeah. I shouldn't even bring that up. It's stupid to say, you know. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, but there there has been a has been times where where yeah fucking I let that shit get to me too, you know. You know where you start seeing the stupid things that these dumbass people and and you're like, who the fuck are you trying to call out somebody? Awesome, like Tim Armstrong, you know, you know? like fuck these people. It's man. Uh, weak people are very dangerous. That's true. Weak people are very dangerous, especially with this fucking social media platform. Yeah, and, shit, and it's dude. very odd. Like Patrice O'Neill said this in an old interview that uh, you know when he was on Opie and Anthony, which was great. He was like, "This was like when Twitter started and things like that." He was like, "You guys shouldn't be able to contact me. I'm better than you." <laughs> you shouldn't like you shouldn't yeah. be able to contact me this is he's like do you think he's like this is a weird age where some asshole from oklahoma gets a word in with george clooney right george clooney sees his <laughs> comment he sh- george clooney shouldn't even know this asshole's alive dude <laughs> and this is where we're in a weird age and i really believe that you know what i mean i know yeah. saying i'm better than you is, is a harsh thing to say but hey nice we get a little telemore do the girl with the telemore do you know the the movie, the girl with the tattoo on her back, or whatever that movie oh, is. Oh, the girl with the dragon tattoo. Dragon tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> Jenna's gonna be like, the girl with the, girl the telemore with the do. Telemore do. <laughs> That's way more smoothly rolled off your tongue. Yeah. yeah. The girl with the, the telemore, telemore do. do. Yeah, I like it. And all she do, she doesn't fight crime. She just brings whiskey. And yeah. Then people stop and people become friends. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, there's some road rage going on. She's like, hey, just shut the fuck up and have a shot. Let's have a shot, guys. Relax. And, and then guys are like, you know, you, you know, they take the shot and they're like. I'm sorry, brother. You know, I don't know why I was acting that. like a fool back Let's there. Let's cheers. Dude. You know, yeah. yeah, you know, it was my fault. Yeah, I didn't realize we were going to come up to this light for yeah. so long and you were going to do something. <laughs> my my AC went out. I got I got leather seats. I got mud butt. <laughs> Fucking kids getting kicked out of school right now, and I'm paying for his college. I, yeah, my wife's taking my shit. I got severe mud. <laughs> <laughs> my my usual hooker ran off my car last my night. My balls dude. are stuck to my leg in this heat. He's having Look, the worst day, dude. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> Can we be friends? Can we just go to the bar together? Can we just cheers? Can we just hit the, hit the pub and say, fuck? <laughs> these bitches <laughs> you know I'd, i would love that would be an interesting show check this out if you catch like a a feud or something um like a road rage and then you you little psychology you kind of be like hey guys what's really causing this shit what's really causing this yeah hey you got time to talk like, hey you all right you're right dude like yeah all right because because i have stopped dudes that were trying to rage with me before i'm like yeah all right yeah. bro like you know what you're doing right now? Yeah, yeah, you okay? You all right? And I, and more times than not, especially like like good examples are like uh like for example Patrice O'Neill where he's he's got into I saw one where where uh there was some online bullshit and then they they came to a one of his show and was like heckling him. Oh, and then he goodness. and then he stopped and was like, "Hey." And then he you know him, he just he just sits oh, there and yeah. goes, "Hey." And he completely got got him out of it. They're like, "You know what?" We're, we're 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 we actually are a big fan, man. We're just we're just pissed off at our own lives. You know, they were just they completely <laughs> broke down, and it was just like that's what happens. They're very very angry individuals at home, and then they're able to write this comment that yep. that goes, you yeah. know what, you you know you look fucking fat in that picture, or you yeah. suck, or 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 whatever, you know. Yeah. You know, and, like, and then it stays there. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, like when Gogo Riot got hit briefly with all that online bullshit, right? And I was contacting them personally. Every one of them apologized. Everyone, or they ignored me. Yeah, uh, that's. There was, yeah, and then the main promoter guy. The way you just said that, Jenna, reminded yeah. me of the Mortal Kombat game where the guys said "toasty" and he came out of the side, but it, pussies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, we we got to do that, dude. Yeah, you're pussy. <laughs> Yeah, you're, you're straight pussies because, yeah. like, look, I'm, if you're gonna say some shit, you, you gotta, right? Yeah, don't be is, a keyboard well, cowboy, it, dude. Well, it's my band. The other guys are my players, so uh, you're gonna have to say that to me. It's different. And you, you know? wanted yeah. to make this personal for some reason. That's kind of. Funny. And I contacted the prom- the main promoter that posts all this bullshit and all this stuff, and I went I went straight at him. I didn't threaten. I go I go, hey man, you know me. You know who I am. We've we've met. We've met in other bands. Uh, all the, all this like. Uh, I don't condone this. I'm handling this on my end. It's not up to you, right? Yep. And I go, I go, go ahead, go ahead and hit me up if we got discussions. Nothing, what, nothing. What'd you hear about that wild shit with uh, Janet Jackson? What was she released a tit? 
many no, years ago. But. No, no, no that, that was great, actually, by the way. God bless her. But anyways. Uh, oh, bless her heart. <laughs> uh, bless her heart. <laughs> but uh, Name no, of the but, cast? Because, yep. uh, because she said that she heard that Kamala Harris wasn't black. She got a okay. bunch of backlash from idiots that okay. take, take that way too far. Okay. So you're talking about an actual black woman that we know is black. Yeah, that <laughs> turned herself white. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But she says something about a question mark over here that's been Indian yeah. forever, and yeah. now nobody knows what the fuck she is, dude. Yeah. She says something out loud, and they wanted to fucking give her shit? Like, of course, it's only them broads from, like, The View and shit that nobody it's listens only, to. Yeah. Yeah, it, nobody cares about these cackling hens, dude. It's always some cackling hen, some white lady with uh, blue hair. No, or red hair, or red hair, or fucking, uh, no, uh, the bride from The View. You know, that, that broad. Or uh, Whoopi Ugh. Goldberg, for some reason. People listen to these fucking idiots. Why is idiots. Whoopi Goldberg... Who have a fucking face on TV? Her, she changed her whole. Her, she changed her name to Whoopi Goldberg, a Jewish name, and then and then she's making dumb. Once once you say once you say, uh, uh, Germ, it, the Nazis weren't. It wasn't about race. It's just a bunch of white people killing them, killing each other. Once you say wow. that, you go. Mm. Do you know? There's different races other than white and black, lady. Yeah. You know, there's Especially different white races. Especially when it comes to the Jews, dude. Do you know how many? Dude. My God, dude. That, My God. That is the fucking... You got to be like, look, bitch, you're stupid. You're yeah, dumb. Definitely. You're, let's just say, you, look, you, you did some cool movies. You did Sister Act. Okay, cool. Cool I, movie. I guess. Now shut up about I it. I guess Ghost. You, you, Ghost was good. You probably should have uh, followed... Ew, her gross, crunchy hands when she was touching him in Ghost. Oh, do you remember that one? Oh, oh I God, do, dude. dude. I do. I forgot about that one. It, it's like having an eagle touch you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember the, the Simpsons, dude, where uh, the guy walks up to the bottomless pit and he's like, I was wrong to think somebody would want pictures, naked pictures of Whoopi Goldberg, and he throws it down the fucking hole, and the hole throws it back out. <laughs> she is gross looking. Dude. Jumping Jack Flash, that was a great movie. You ever yeah. seen that one? Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. I think that's the 80s, 80s greatest movies. Yeah. Uh, yeah, dude. But nobody's ever thought that Whoopi Goldberg was attractive, or first or, of all. Or, or anything. Or had a mind to speak about anything, because at the end of the day, who the fuck is she? Some moron. She was a comedian. She was a good comedian and uh and and she's a good actor. Let's just let's just say look that's you. She now shut up about it. She wasn't a good comedian. She might have been thrown into the category of comedian, but I mean, she never honest, made me laugh. Right, to be honest, I think I saw something when I was a child that I thought I think I laughed. No, you're thinking Wanda Sykes. No, uh, boy. She can squeeze the laugh out of me. <laughs> she can squeeze it out of you. <laughs> yeah, dude. Wanda Sykes's last special is awful, dude. Oh I, my god. I haven't seen it. Is she terrible? Haven't seen it, but I have seen some fucking clips here and there where she does make me laugh. If she's not talking to Larry David, she sure is a wet rag, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't doubt it, dude, because she annoys she me. She needs Larry to make her funny. <laughs> God damn, dude. See that voice. Oh, that, that thing you got to Slap that wig off her. You got to get past that, yeah, but... But it, that's why I'm saying, like, it's got to be when you Cheers, see it baby. in you a go. quick little clip, dude, you know? Yeah. That's, that's the only way I can handle it. Hey, when did Ghost come out? Uh, 90s, early 90s. 90s? Oh, okay. Because I, I, I would say the 80, like 86 to 89 was like the greatest time for movies, oh, man. Dude, trust me. I've been trying to watch Police Such Ac great movies. I've been trying to watch Police Academy, dude. Yes. Because that shit, yes. dude. I just saw a little clip of fucking Michael Winslow fucking dude, yeah. and he's doing the fucking machine. Oh, he's great, shit. dude. And I was like, fuck yeah, dude. Hey, uh, I watched a um, uh, a documentary on Caddyshack, how they shot Caddyshack. That's, that's a wild one. Oh, it's beautiful. Did you see that? Yeah. Oh, you did. That was a wild one. That dude. was a wild one. Caddyshack. You know, because I love I love uh, Rodney Dangerfield. <laughs> yeah, fucking Bill Murray, dude. But it's funny. They throughout the movie they changed they changed who uh, how it was written and why because uh, like Rodney Dangerfield was like an afterthought. And yeah. then he came on there was was like and changed it was it like all oh up. he just changed it they're like yeah yeah yep. we, we need more of that and then there wasn't enough Bill Murray then they're like yeah. we need to write some shit for Bill Murray and then there's Chevy Chase and you know fucking yeah yep. yeah I mean they had Chevy Chase Bill Murray because yeah. it was actually it was written specifically about the caddies yeah. and they'd follow that the one actor's name but it's that was so in, I love watching that because that's. That's Hollywood I love, dude. Dude, that's cinema its finest, sir. You want to sit in the chair, baby? You can, sit in the, you can be on, you want to be on camera? Yeah, no, I want to be on camera. Oh, okay. You're pretty without makeup. You're good. Yeah, all right. What is this, HealthNet calling me at fucking? HealthNet. HealthNet, dude. 
Hey, it is healthy. Here, let, here, hold on. Let, let's answer. Hello? Hello? Hey, good afternoon. Uh, my name is Caesar, and I'm calling from Complex Care Solutions on behalf of Health Out of California. Yeah, hi, Caesar. How can I help you? Hey, uh, so we were looking to speak with uh, Ian Levitt. Uh, he's not in right now. Can I take a message? Uh, what, what's this regarding? I'm, I'm his assistant. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, so we were just reaching out to him to set up a time for a personal health visit. And it's just an annual health assessment at no cost. They want to stick their fingers in your butt, dude. They want to uh, stick uh, their fingers uh, in your a, butt. A personal health, uh, are they're coming to his house? Uh, I'm not sure about the specific um, visit here, but I can I can take a look and see if it lets me. Yeah, I, yeah let me know because he, he travels a lot. Because mm-hmm. okay. right now he's in Indiana. Okay. Uh um, so yeah, so this one's a person. It's a personal health visit, like an in-home assessment. Okay. And so we just wanted to let him know that he has that available. Uh, oh, it's an in-home home. assessment. Wow. Okay. Uh, I think he'll be available in uh, October sixteenth. I see here. Like October sixteenth. Yeah. Okay. We can we can try and push like a a call back for mm-hmm. around that time then, or October the sixteenth. Mm-hmm. Um, see if we can get that. Okay, sounds good. Yeah, go ahead and, go ahead and uh, give him a call back, and uh, hopefully I'll still be employed. <laughs> okay, thank you for your call. All right, thank you. Goodbye. Yeah, they want to stick their fingers in your butt. What dude. is that? They want, they want to come over. And they just... want to come to your house to stick their finger in your butt, dude. Hey, they want you to be as comfortable as you could be, sir. <laughs> Why don't they stick their finger in your butt, dude? Yeah, go, go ahead, Jenny. You want to plug in the mic? I got one in here for you. Yeah. Oh, but you, okay. You know, you don't have to do that anymore, right? What? Yeah, I know. You don't have to get a finger up you anymore. Because you have That's. No, because I already got the. Uh, it's. I don't have the temporary. I have the. 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 The total. Yeah, that. Oh, is that what? You, because I'm handicapped, is that why? Hmm. That's interesting. What a weird call. They want to come here. Like, why don't I? Don't, you know what I mean? That's so fucking weird to me. I've never heard of that. I mean, I would have ignored that if I if we weren't because I, I thought it might be entertaining. Who knows? I thought it was going to be another Habib, and I thought I was going to be able to do the same voice back yeah. at him, dude. But now nah, he... you hear his dumb laugh on the other end, dude. And I was like, maybe I'll be <laughs> employed. No, 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 no. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, wow, this chicken feeder, dude. <laughs> you <laughs> know, you didn't think that was funny, <laughs> you asshole. Chicken feeder, dude. Get the <laughs> fuck out of here. No, I mean that guy seemed American, right? Was he American? No, you said that you are in, in Indiana. Oh, yeah, I'm in yeah. Indiana. Yeah, 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 yeah. So silly, dude. Whatever, you know, dude. Hey, you know, what, coming up with shit off the top of your head, and what, you, know, you actually are your own assistant, so you're not lying. I'm technically an, an assistant, but I don't know. Well, because I don't want to say that's me, because then we'll go into some fucking sales pitch as to why he needs to come over and stick his thumb up my ass. Yep. He's going to be like, because yep. I need you to be as comfortable as you can, sir, while yep. I spread your eagle on your, <laughs> on your fucking couch, dude. Yeah, why, why <laughs> do you want to come here? That's so weird to me. Because he wants to do something to your butt, dude. Home health oh, assessment? For what? What good does that do me? Oh, like access to bars or something, you know, like... Because can I get some... Can I have a doctor come to my home instead of I have to go there? That'd be awesome. They can paint your curb blue because you're handicapped and you live here. Yeah. So nobody could ever park there. And, yeah, I don't yeah. want the curb blue. I, I don't want the curb blue neither unless we, <laughs> we got skateboards and we can... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> unless we can make it slick. <laughs> no, right? Okay, you don't have a mic, baby. It's really hard. Everything's... I can't hear you. Yeah, I'll tell you about it. You know, headphones and everything. But that's just... That's weird to me. But I would rather... See, that's what I want. I want a doctor to come to me. I don't want to go to the hospitals. You know what I mean? As much as we pay for I don't want to go to the hospitals. For going to the doctors and then paying for the fucking parking ticket. Well... And then fucking wasting all my time. I was talking to my dad the other day. We were just talking about, what if you win the lottery? You know what I mean? And I go, uh, I'd probably do everything the same, just better. But also, um, I would insulate myself so I don't have to talk to uh, dipshits most of my life. And also, I'd get an in-home doctor. 
I want no, you wouldn't. You'd I want to. You'd become a doctor. I want a personal doctor. You'd become a doctor, I, 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 because you'd get so interested in it, dude. Well, that's yeah. probably true. Yeah. But I mean, I get interested. It's hard to be a doctor for everything, but you know what I mean. Like, I don't want to have to go to the doctor, and I want a guy that that is specifically to to me and well, my family's needs. You well, know, that's that's what I'm saying. See, if yeah. you had the time to where you can pay somebody to take care of all your bullshit, yeah, while you had extra time to do anything that you wanted yeah fuck yeah you're gonna look up you're gonna look up the shit that's wrong with you yeah and how you could well, i do that make now it better yeah i you, do that now and i can't find shit I, you and me both uh, bro but hey yeah um yeah i mean i just i would insulate myself so i only communicate with um uh, you know people that'll up my my brain yeah yeah you know I, I, so family friends and then yeah. and then people that would up my brain that's it mm-hmm. Yeah, anything that goes. No, he doesn't need a bunch of people for that. Just, just one. I know. Well, I, I want to be insulated. Is basically it. Like when I have to go to a Home Depot and pick up some shit, and I got to talk to a fucking idiot. And now I know this idiot Look, exists. She's right. She's talking about personal assistant to hand. Yeah. 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 I, I don't want to. I don't want to do anything that is. It, it's. But what sucks is I like doing those. I like going to Home Depot. It's nice. Uh, it's the people me, that I don't me, like. Me, not so much. Not a Home Depot. It's the people uh, I don't Ace, like. Ace Hardware. Okay. I love to visit there, Ace. You know what I mean. Yeah. yeah. But, but yeah, there, even the stuff that we used to love as kids, like Home Depot, going to a fucking hardware store that everybody knows and shit, a Lowe's, you know, yeah. now they're all a bunch of fuck bags. Yeah, dude. they are. Yeah, it's they're, bad. they're all fuck bags. So dude. you're right with like an Ace Hardware. But, yeah. you know, here in these cities, big, Mon stores, in big dude. cities, they don't have the general store. They don't have those hardware I got a, stores. I got know. an Ace right up on my street, and my street's full of bars and fucking. You know, that's true. We had an Ace shit. over there on 2nd, and those, those boys. Uh, They'll take you right where you need to go. They go yeah. like, I go, hey man, I need like a joint that fixes or whatever the fuck. And they go, oh shit, let's go. You know, they'll walk over to you and go, you know what? I tried this at my home and all this shit, and I love I, that. The aisles like this. Yeah, the aisles are terrible. Yeah, yeah. It, but yeah. but yeah, that's no shit because this file that this fucking this chick pulled for me because I was like, yeah, I got this notch that you know it's it's to secure, secure shelves and shit. Mm. It looks like a little barrel with a screw side into it and whatnot. Like, I got this random one, but I need, like, 12 of these things. She's like, oh, yeah, it's right over here. Let me take you over here. Love that. And then, bam, and I was like. You know what sucks? The fact that we're amazed by someone that knows their job, isn't that weird? It is. Uh, isn't that fucking weird? It, it sucks. We shouldn't it, be amazed. It sucks that it's come to that. They're just nobody, doing their job. Nobody takes any pride anymore. When someone knows their job, I go, oh, my God, thank you yep. so much. You're exactly who I only want to deal with. You but, know? And, but And they're like, no, we're all this good. It, and they're like, get the fuck out of here. I think, I think we're, now, I don't know, so, you know, like in Texas, and when we were in Austin, everywhere I asked, people are so goddamn helpful. Went to Seven Eleven. The dude just fucking walked out. It was, you know, it was a white guy though. Mm-hmm. But the guy walks out because I was at. What did I ask him? I uh, uh, I asked him uh, some directions or like a. Uh, um, and he walked out of the set and was like, "Oh yeah!" Like walked right up the door. He go this way. And he's, you know, he's like he's helping me out. Like he's so happy to help. You know what I mean? And I was like, "That's so weird, man." Hey, well check it out. There's this one time where this guy's like, "Hey, you know where this fucking dealership's at?" And I was like, "Yeah, dude, you just." You know, go up here, gave him directions and everything, and drives off happy. And one of my friends was like, hey, that was real nice of you. And I was like, yeah. You know, I gave the guy directions, even though I didn't know where he was going, because that's the kind of guy I am. <laughs> so he's all looking around like, yeah. what the fuck? <laughs> hey, I have, d- I have done that, where someone asked me for directions, like where a street is, and I pointed them the wrong way. And then after, I go, oh, shit. I tried to like chase him down, dude. It's I've done like, that too, but I've like, done. Ah, man, I've done it on purpose too. For some reason, I don't know. Just every once in a while, you know, you, you get that 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 hankling. I go, yeah, yeah, it's up your ass, yeah, dickhead. Yeah, it's <laughs> fucking right over there, dude. <laughs> no, I, I, yeah, I'll just go. Like, ah, I don't know. I don't. Know. Yeah, I, I think he might have been sporting a Biden sticker on his car. I think that's why I did that to him. But well, of course he's lost. <laughs> he's got an electric <laughs> car. Why he's always lost. Gonna ask me for directions. He's gonna, he, yeah. <laughs> he'll, he'll drive around the corner, come back. Hey. I don't know if I talked to you earlier, but I was asking some guy for some questions. I, man, I bet you all Biden supporters are <coughs> terrible with directions. <laughs> Brain dead and terrible with directions. <laughs> relax, buddy. Relax. Thank you. That's all you got to say. You just tell him to relax. He'll stop. He's getting, he's getting fired up. He's getting fired up. Baron's getting fired up, dude. Remember b- before all the GPS shit? 
where it was like uh, you had to give people a whole list. And it's like when you see the tree that's leaning over to the left, oh, you're no. going to want to make a right. No, let me give you one better than that because I know you used to use this shit too, that, uh, that Thomas guy. Yeah, the Thomas guy. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I had a Thomas guy. I highlighted. I, I, had, I had everything where all the fucking you where mean, all the pay phones were in, in Los Angeles. You don't have that anymore? No. Nah, As a I backup? Wish I did. As a backup? I wish had? I had the original because that would be fun to watch, to look at because I made marks throughout it. You know what I mean? I'd love yeah, to see that. Yeah, but all, most of that shit's changed. I wish I still had all the maps here in when, I, when I toured too. And, you know, when Shot Down it went on tours, we, you know, the, I wish I had the maps that we had because that would have been fun to watch just, because we just we were riding on it. And then you see the holes from me punching through it and just like, <laughs> getting all angry. God damn it, Alan. This is not fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the goddamn map. <laughs> <laughs> fucking asshole. Uh, yeah, we and, uh, uh, in Utah, man. Fucking like we were in some weird Utah hills that we, you know, we couldn't see the map in the dark. It's just a single road in the fucking giant hills. We we're lost. It was brutal. I was like, Jesus Christ, dude. Now nowadays, you look back. Now it's like. You tell that story to anybody who doesn't know about that time frame, they'll be like, well, why didn't you just pull out your phone? Yeah. Uh, No, sir. Why didn't you just pull out your laptop? What? The satellite wasn't in the right position? Yeah, I mean, you pull pull that big, you had that big map, and then you go, look, we're here. Let's see. And you have to follow the But where I need to be is on the next page. (laughs) It doesn't look that far. You know, it's only a few inches over. Jesus. Yeah. No... Imagine that. No kid will ever know what it's like to get directions. To read maps. Read maps. Read, well, wow. Well, my, son, my son's going to... Come on, dude. I'm great, well, I mean, with, I'm great with navigation. Without fucking... Without this shit. Yeah, but, but I mean... But if you have it, you might as well use the motherfucker. But No, nah, because I feel like you're being lazy and using that as a crutch. Hmm. And you should just rely on yourself and not this fucking thing. Because one day they're all going to I mean, I think they're it, all look like this. They're all yeah. going to go black. Nothing's going to be provided I for you. I can't wait, dude. I Nothing can't wait. Nothing will be provided for you. And you're going to have to rely on yourself. There will be a day where it all goes out. Yep. And I can't. Just one day. And I can't wait. Mm-hmm. I'm actually looking forward to that. I kind of am, too. Yeah. Because maybe people will fucking pay attention to what they're doing. Of course, my luck, it'll be the day a big money transfer comes up, right as the money. No, you know what's going to suck is is I would be bitching about people are always on their phones when they fucking drive, and then it's going to be because it's black and they're paying attention yeah. to trying to get it back on or something, dude, that makes them crash. So even when it's dead, dude, it still makes them crash, dude. Imagine the, the gridlock that would happen on the freeways, the L.A. Oh, freeways. Now they don't know where the fuck they're going. Nobody knows where they're going. They're, you see? You see? I, I mean, uh, just think about because you've been in places where you don't get reception, right? Yep. And you do start to go, oh, shit. Okay, I got. I better pay attention to where, where, what streets I've been passing. Things yeah. like that. Yeah. Yeah. Especially up, uh, up at the cabin. Mm-hmm. You know, fucking, yep. man, man, you hit uh, the bottom town in uh, San Bernardino, but you mm-hmm. go up in the, the hills. Yeah, there's nothing. And you got to remember these tiny little snake tubes and shit. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, and in, uh, in Yosemite or Sugar Pine, where my mom is, is uh, it starts to flicker in and out. Like yeah. it, it used to be zero. Now, now you got you get some. Yeah, you know, but you still you got to know these little windy things. As no shit, it, it, it is pretty wild, especially when it snows, dude. Because everything looks yep. different when it snows. Mm, yeah, I mean, street signs are covered. Yep, stop signs are covered. Yeah, that little mole hill you used to see, now that thing is just fucking powder. Wow, yeah. man. Really think about that. This it's this is an interesting time. This is an interesting time. I don't mind the barking, baby. This it's okay. Is, this is a great time where real men can be forged into even greater men. And the pussy little weak links that we fucking see walking around on a daily basis complaining about everything are right. going to get stomped the fuck out. Dude. I do think this is... There's um, every generation, there's always something to rebel against, I think. And that's why, you know, like, that's why I always love punk rock music and, you know... Yep. But the, well, there's a great divide, I would say too. Like, there's a great divide. There's, there's at one point you got to be like, this is where I draw the line. Like, mm. you stay over on that side, I'll stay over on mine. Yeah, like, like you know, when we talked about the the guys that want to be girls, and you're like, it's hey, still a guy. Just, yeah, but I mean, uh, just you're still a guy. There's, I've always been that way too. It's like, uh, if that's you, you're, you're you'll be over there. Zombie apocalypse happen, I won't be calling you. Definitely not. It'll be all right. I you're, won't be calling you. Yeah, you're already not going to have a plan because 
Yeah, you have a plan with what you're doing. Yeah, I I saw you tweet out that you you should take uh, all the guns from citizens. Well, then, look, you're not in my apocalypse team. No, definitely not. Okay, when the zombies start coming, uh, they start coming over. They're at the window. Their face is against the window, right? They're they're already here. They're just not at the windows yet. But there's a lot of fucking zombies out there, dude. Oh, yeah. Well, you're in Long Beach. Yep. I haven't seen as much anymore because I'm over here. Oh, uh, but. uh, I was going to tell you, too. Oh, I see. They're closing down the senior center that, remember when you were like, oh, I wanted to move my pops into that place, and I told you, no, that fucking place is horrible. Well, the bums have moved in and caked the place up so much with fucked up shit that, yeah, they're closing that place down, which is going to turn into a bum hotel, which means that everybody in my family is going to fucking have to start carrying guns, dude. These motherfuckers are nuts. Hey, get out of there, buddy. Come Uh, come over here. uh, One of these days. Come over here, bub. One of these Let's days. Let's go. I still got my kid in his school, and everything's going good yeah, with that. You can drive him farther. I know. But by the time, just, how about this? Just start looking at the move, you know, and by the time he graduates and shit, you'll be, you'll be all set, dude. No. Nope. going to be covered in actual living There's a, you do yeah. forget. Like, uh, we, we're in an area where it's not so much, but when you, I, there are a few zombies around here. Like, that Ralph's up the street. Is mm. is no joke sometimes, dude. And it's funny, dude. You you forget. You're just like, oh <laughs> shit, bunch of homeless dudes and weirdos and 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 people bothering poor guys just trying to fucking <laughs> get yep. through the day, you know. But uh, yeah, I was in. In fact, I I went down to the dump in uh, Huntington Beach. Hey, all right, buddy, relax. Thank you. But you forget. So I was I'm driving through Long Beach, stop and get gas in the RV, and uh uh. Yeah, there's real life zombies just in the middle of the street, just mm, dude, just stopping traffic, begging you know? to be hit. They want to fuck your car up, dude, and I yeah. hate that, dude. I'm I, I get tired of that, and especially when you see the cops driving down the opposite side of the street. <laughs> the cops aren't doing shit, dude. Uh, well, I guess what can what can they do? What are they gonna do with the guy? That's the fucked up part. Is they're demanded not to do their fucking job anymore. Yeah, pop dude. that for me, would you? Yeah, they they're told they can't do their job in this fucking faggoty <sighs> state, dude. Well. Um, what are they going to do with a homeless guy, a crazy homeless guy anyways? What could you possibly do? You, know, you got to put him in jail and, and then... Well, this is... This and is then the, uh, uh, tax dollars, I don't know. Well, no, well this is the, the thing Feed that, him that shitty bologna sandwich you get. That feud that I got with uh, Gavin Newsom. That because soggy lettuce. There has been money spent on the homeless crisis. Not one fucking dollar has gone to him because well, that money gets robbed from that fucking pot too, man. Yeah, no, that's a scam. Yeah. The homeless I, is and a it's scam. It's always been, and, it, and it's yeah. showing, dude, yeah. worse now than it ever has. I envy you guys for that one. I want in. I want in on that scam, dude. No, nah, I couldn't. Let st- me in. I couldn't steal from people that don't have anything. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm steal and give it back. I'm like Robin Hood. That, but that's what that money's meant for, you know. Yeah, but it's not gonna. But you can't. You can't help these people. Some of them you can. Very, very few. Because if they could be helpable, their families would have already. You it's give- very few that they're like a war vet where their family died, you know, and they're older. It's very few. And the and the VFWs and and what you know, veterans should be ha- should be helping them. That's where that should be. Not not the government, the vet the vets organization should be helping. Yeah, well, it it started off that that's how it used to be. And then for a little while it had to be us vets taking care of each other vets. Yes. And, and now the the VA, I'm not going to lie. VA, thank you. I'm not going to saying VFW. I'm not going to I'm not going to lie. In the last few years they have stepped up their game. It's it's made. That's a what lot Angel of, was telling me. Angel was telling me that it stepped it's stepped up. It, it's made a lot easier for for dudes, you know. But but still, there's there's a there's a lot of other people that that feel the same way, dude. That just aren't being listened. Is to. there a way we can like scan a homeless dude and be like, hey, uh, what were your accomplishments? What's your family? You know what I mean? Like if you're if you're an ex vet, I go let's 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 see what we can do for you, right? But if you're just a uh, a well, fucking tweaker kid. Most of the time, it is bullshit. When you when yeah. you when you see the the vets that you know holding cardboard signs, they're shit. not they're not really vets. No, nah, and you can ask or that dishonorable d- discharge because they didn't want to fucking march they, or something. Then dude, they still they, have the picture. They got kicked out of boot camp <laughs> kind of shit. They got yeah. kicked out of boot camp, yeah. but they still have the picture. Yeah, uh, and know, they uh, use that to this day. They use it to this day. Haven't got anything on that uniform yet, bro? On on Memorial Day, they fucking. The, my brothers, my brothers that I lost in boot camp because they kicked <laughs> us all out. Yeah, yeah. There's those guys too. Trust me. Yeah, trust me. There's a lot of people that want want other people to feel sorry for them, no matter what the 
But you're saying reason. you're saying some. There, yes, there's always some of something, right? No. Yep. But most of the homeless folks were assholes their whole life. I mean, that's 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 a fact. That's a fact, guys. Can we just say that? Oh well, I'm not going to deny that neither. I'm not. I'm going to tell you the CIA trick right now. Oh, I'm okay. Neither, go ahead. I'm neither going to confirm nor deny that uh, remark you just made. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, do you know what I mean by that? Meaning that I'm telling the truth. That yes, that's true. Or you couldn't be. All <laughs> right. Yeah, I just told you you could be saying the truth, or you could be lying in one fucking little thing like that. Well, I'm saying the truth in my eyes. All right. I guess that's the best way to do it. But I'm saying in my eyes. Yeah, the you, way I see. You it. could be, or you couldn't be. But I'm not going <laughs> to. Thank tell you, you, Kamala. I'm not going. Uh, I'm yeah. not going to tell you one way how I think. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on. But I'll give you the Thanks. two options. <laughs> All right. Thank you for that, dude. It just, just leaves you like, how do I talk to this what person? The- <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what I don't know what to do for this great. point. Oh, that was what his inten- intended purpose. But too, but doesn't that make sense? Like uh, if, if you weren't if you weren't an asshole, right? Like like if if you yourself, if you Justin Swan mm. was go, I just hit. I, I'm having hard times, man. I'm out of I'm out of my place. I go. Well, guess oh. what? You're in here, buddy. Well, with friends and family, I I I go. You're you're moving in. I go, re- come on in. I already know yeah. the love with friends and family. And vice versa, there'd, there'd be no problem, right? Yeah. But why don't they have that? Hmm. Because they've been a problem to everybody they've ever they've been around. Because they've cheated and stolen from, and, 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 and hurt. And used and up everybody. every last resource and don't yeah. give a fuck about their life. Yeah, and, and I've said I, I, we have one in, yeah. in, in my family. In yeah. my family, we have a homeless person. We have a homeless lady that yells at people That is in true. my family. But there has been, a, you know, dumbasses because, you know, fucking everybody's been, uh, you know, addicted to one thing at one time or another. And, you know, yeah. may, maybe you're just seeing them at their low spot being mm-hmm. addicted to said drug. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, and you can bring them out of that. Sure. That's, that's not a hard thing I'm, to I'm do. I'm with you on that. Mm-hmm. You know, so there's, I mean, there's some. It's it's hard to find nowadays, though. Right. But, but they're all. Ad- but, man, I can't. You See, what happens, though, is you're blaming the drug rather than them just being an asshole. No, I'm just saying once you, know? you, once you separate them from the drug. They can become, they can be back to the person they used to be. Sure. And then you're not dealing with asshole sure, version, right. you know. But if if they have chosen the drug over their family and over, uh, you know, they stole from their mother, they uh, uh, alienated their whole family. Addiction's a powerful uh, thing, man. They've taken money. They've, uh, they won't get a job. They yeah. won't do anything. Well, what good are they anyways? You know what I mean? Like, if you're not going to get a job or help out the family, well, I really have this belief that uh, I need to chop your head off. <laughs> and let's I, hang you. I would smoothly agree with you, but like I said, you're you know, useless. Separate them from that fucking that thing that's turning them into that person. Sure, and it'll be a whole different story. But people, uh, right? But you're you're giving the drug too much power. You're saying no. They already did because they're they're ruining everything with it. Right, but, but they don't see. But that you're they're... blaming the drug versus them. No, I'm. I'm just gonna say them with the drug is a. It's a bad combination. Yeah, sure. I, I feel that it's like a, because I could do that said drug. Much. I could do that said or drug whiskey and do and be fine. Or no, but or whiskey. We uh. we do too much whiskey and now we're a problem, right? That that does happen to me from time to time. But sure. But that's when it's too much at a fast pace. You know. Right, but are you blaming the whiskey? Are you blaming yourself? Myself with okay. with uh, my personality. Yeah. Sure. Then. Why are we blaming the drug with said said homeless person over here? I'm not blaming the drug. I'm just saying once you separate them, you yep. know, you can get them back. Right, but they are adults. If if you can, you propose to separate. You give them money. You give them. You give no, them I'm an ap- giving, apartment. No, well, say you do. Say they're, say they're a family member. Say they're a brother right. that went off the rails, dude. Right. And uh, and then you go. You know what, buddy? I got some extra cash. Let me let me mm. get you a. Uh, I'm gonna get you an apartment, but I need you to stay off the coke. Let's say coke. Right. I need you to stay off that coke. Uh, and then he fucking spray paints the whole fucking apartment and and nails the window shut and is doing coke all day. And he's got a pile bigger than you've ever seen laying on his chest while he's watching Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. A, a pile of coke? Damn, yeah. That sounds awesome. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I was just describing like my fun zone right now. But- <laughs> You, you, you mean you mean having all the fun? Is that what you mean? Yeah, that's that's exactly what I meant. Well, I'm saying like a see, Coke was bad because 
you know, I should say a gross drug, like like tweak. Okay, meth or like right. a right. Let's meth just say or meth. heroin or something. Like a bad heroin, not even good heroin, like yeah, shitty, filthy, dirty, dirty filthy. shit. That's, yeah. Yeah. Crack. Yeah, and he's, crack. And he's he's uh, screwed the window shut. He's uh, <laughs> he's got know, a foil hat. He's got the. He thinks the <laughs> government's coming after him. It's like everybody's the, after him. And it's like no one cares about you, you <laughs> no, loser. You're not that important, dude. You, yeah, you don't even have a bank account. <laughs> like no one cares about you. <laughs> if you just realized how unimportant you were, all this would go. Yeah, away. the narcissism is just <laughs> through the roof, dude. It's like, oh, the government's after you. <laughs> really? You have never c- accomplished a damn thing in life ever. <laughs> okay, all right. That's who they're after, yeah. and you're dumb. Yeah, yeah. You, you're not inventing anything. You're not. <laughs> you didn't invent the the car that runs on hydrogen, water. Yeah, you know, fucking none of that. That fucking guy, dude. You, you know the guy yeah. that they they offed. I do, or that they claim. I did not. I was just told about it, and now my brain's running with it. Oh, I went. Down, I haven't even. I went down that rabbit hole years ago, and yeah. yes, that's a all verified. Yep. And and then we'll close out. Uh, because you, uh, we haven't seen. We didn't do a cast last week, so we're going a little long today. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, w- what blows my mind, I get how people get off because that ruins your bottom dollar. That's ruining your business, right? Oh, that's how a lot of people get off. For dude. sure. And that's been since. But we just go, okay, we're done with it. It is what it is, right? Oh, how horrible. All these Like. Little, yeah. <laughs> all, right. Exactly. That's a perfect way to put it. Like and done. Or you leave a comment, go, oh, I, 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 uh, my heart goes my, out to Israel. That's a great one. My heart goes out. That's a great <laughs> one. I, my job is done. <laughs> Social justice warrior. My job is done. You know, I can. Dun, dun. So it's a team. That's another one you got to watch. A team's great. Yep. Oh my God. Dude, mash. Fucking, fucking mash. Dude. Mash is a great one. So, but with all these, let's just. Let's just uh, it, like uh, with the, with the Epstein with, with the Epstein Island. Okay, done and done. We're we're just done with this, guys. Uh, fucking COVID, the <laughs> vaccine, the <laughs> fact that they force people to give. Yeah, vac- we lied to you. That we sh- and nobody's gonna do anything. That we sh- that we stopped. That we shut down people's businesses and life and, and how they feed their kids. Destroyed and, fucking people's and, businesses and, and, and lives. And we're just we're just done with it. We're it's okay. We're we're cool. You oh, know what this is like. You know what we're like. You know what idiocracy. Okay, yes, but we're like a uh, we're like the wife that gets beat. <laughs> it just keeps coming and just, back and just goes. He had a hard day. You know what? He he's didn't got, mean it that time. He's he, got a lot his on his mind. Fist wasn't all the way closed. You see, you see, Kelly. He loves yeah, me. Yeah, he, <laughs> he, yeah. He he has a lot on his mind. Yeah, it, that, that's he, what we are. He's under a lot of pressure. We're, and, and he's got to release it somehow. But yeah, we, we, <laughs> they let us, and 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 I'm very bitter a little bit about these because it, it hit me personally. So you shut down my businesses. You uh, uh, you made uh, my friends get fucking vaccines that they don't need. So and, and also, I was also going through surgeries at the time. So it, that made that very difficult. I couldn't way more complicated. Way more. It, it made things ever so hard. My friend. Uh, uh, mother was dying, couldn't go see her, right, because of this stupid thing. Yep, so he, he could yeah. never get that back. His mother died, and he, he never got to see her because she uh, lived, well, you know, because well, he had to catch a plane. Uh, uh, that, that sucks, but, uh, yeah, my mother-in-law died. Yeah. And she was, she was like, she was like my other mama, you know, and uh, when they were trying to say that I can't see her, I was like, babe, I don't care if I got to get your fucking scrubs from fucking your job. We got to dress up like fucking cleanly janitor workers. I got all the shit, man. You yeah. know, fucking, I don't care I mean, what we got to do. And, and, and I have uh, family members right now, you know, that, that are, are regretting that, uh, that vaccine. They don't know if, if the reason why they're having health problems all of a sudden. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying that's why, and they don't know that's why, but all of a sudden. Could be. But my point is, is some to, Just because there could be, I would, I would say... To, I mean, who knows? More than likely. But to inject, we we are just, we just allowed that. And now, okay, so we were wrong. We were all scared. Okay, cool, cool. But can we say like, holy shit, we were fucking wrong. God damn, let's fix this shit. But people are just like, well, it is what it is. We got beat. We got slapped around a little bit. And he loves me. Uh, no, yeah. No, not only beat, slapped around a little bit, but then bent over the fucking uh, kitchen table and raped. Yep. 
Yeah. I it, mean, it, it, it is weird. It's the same. Because that's the same. Because you getting, know what Barron's oh, doing? Barron's like, yeah, just like you motherfuckers let Michael Vick still play football. That's what he's saying. Sons of bitches. That's what he's like. He's, he, you know Can't what he, believe you people nowadays. You know what he did to my fucking, <laughs> with my species? You guys saw this, right? And you yeah. still just rolled by like it was nothing? Barron's like, let me at Michael Vick. I'll fuck that dude up. Yeah, I'll eat his soul. I'll fucking <laughs> bite that motherfucker, dude. <laughs> All right, guys, let's get out of here. <laughs> Cheers, brother. Down the head.